Hello everyone, my name is Shlis. This is the JJ Muti Slash Ash Game Reviews. How are now I'm doing my uh basically the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles trilogy review. I got season I got uh, the first movie, the second movie, and third movie on Blu-ray. And here's the thing, I don't hate none of these films. I even like the third film. Here's the thing. If what this uh, what the original movie, you get the whole origin of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. How, how they the Splinter, April O'Neil, we get Casey Jones, um, and we get Raphael, Donatello, and I love the costumes. The costumes get so much emotion to the characters. We get the whole backstory of the basically the shred, not basically the shred, uh, basically the backstory of the Shredder, Splinter, and his master Rokusaki. We get the whole uh, Foot Clan and all that stuff. We get nearly every single thing about this. This was such a great film. Teeny Mutant Ninja Turtles number one. If you've never seen it, you should totally check it out. The fight scene's amazing. The story's awesome. All the Teeny Mutant Turtles have their abilities. We know Michelangelo is a funny one. Raphael's a hothead, along with Casey Jones, his buddy in crime. Leonardo's a responsible one. And uh, Donatello, uh, he's a smart brain. Yeah, we get that, and we love it. And I love this film. I gave that a 9.2 out of 10. I love the first film. Now, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, The Secret of the Ooze. This goes a little backstory of the whole, uh, uh, how they were born of the ooze and what it was. The little chemical thing. They get to the backstory of where they found it, that company. Um, we get to see more comedy moments, more action moments. Shredder returns. He, he gets, like, the, it also takes a great point from the comics. Because it also has the freaking, uh, Tosar and Razar, um, I believe that their name are. Forgive me if I said it wrong, but uh, they bring more mutants, uh, bigger a bigger turtle, spiky turtle, snapping turtle, a wolf, and they just go against the turtles. They're going against them, and it's really about them finding a new place because they live with April Neil now. Now they're finding a new place. It's just a new chapter in the Teeny Mutant Ninja Turtles movie. And I love this film as well. I gave this an 8.7. I love this film. Not as good as the first one, but the second one was pretty dang good. And the Super Shredder at the end. Yeah, it was cheesy. I didn't like the final fight scene, but whatever. I like the whole Go Ninja, Go Ninja, Go. Yes, great. Uh, that was a pretty dang good movie. Now, number three. Everyone hates number three. Everyone I know likes this. Oh, it's so bad. Here's the thing. What, main, the, what I could enjoy about this film a little bit is the costumes. The costumes are terrible. With the first two Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle movies, we get to see the costume. We get to see the emotions. We can see them move their lips. And we kind of could tell what they're saying. Number three, I swear, they just go like this, and you just expect words to come out. Because it's they really have no facial uh, expressions at all. The going through time stuff, eh, it's iffy. But I like to see Fuel Japan. I like how the turtles respond in the new age, and how the people think they're demons, and so many... I actually enjoyed this film. I also like Raphael with the little kid Yoshi and then how he bonds with them. It's like, uh, kids. But the thing is what kills it in some ways because it does take away their personality. Raphael is not a total hothead in this one. Leonardo doesn't take, like, leadership role. To me, Michelangelo and Don Toll stay the same to their characters. But not so much Leonardo and Raphael. I don't hate this film. I don't think this is the best film. I don't think it's a crappy film. I... And it's not a great film either, but I think Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number three, it's a okay to good film. I don't hate this film at all that much. So out of a ten, I'm gonna give this like a seven point eight out of ten. I don't hate this film. I thought the trilogy was still good, and I thought it was total bullshit that they didn't do a number four. Oh, I there was a number four, but apparently there was honest, and there was a a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle, a female version, and I didn't like. I don't I don't know where I could find that one no more. I, I look everywhere, no one has that. So I'm just gonna try to find that one to get a review up on that, even though I didn't like that because it dealt with magic and science. But and I also introduced a female Teeny Mutant Ninja Turtle, which I was okay with, but eh, kind of iffy about that entire story. But overall, I love the Teeny Mutant Ninja Turtles. I seen the old uh, TV show when they had April Neil in a yellow uh, tight jumpsuit. Uh, the Teen Nate Mutant Ninja Turtles, the old-fashioned one I know about, the, the one I grew up with, with the whole uh, CW, uh, it ran from 2003 to 2009, L love that TV show as well, now they have a new one on Cartoon Network, I believe it is, 
But overall, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles number uh, one through three, I, I find I find these a, a good trilogy. I really enjoy number one. Number one again is a nine point two. Number two, uh, I get eight point five, eight point seven, and number three, I gave it like a seven point eight or eight. I don't hate this film at all. So overall, yes, if you want to enjoy some Teenage Mutant Turtles movies, just for the hell of it, go back in time and. And find out, see, just go back in time and enjoy yourself like a childhood or anything, or even just a good regular movie. If you're an adult and you don't want to see like a total kids movie, I say watch the first one. The first one's the best one. It has a good amount of drama, good amount of action, good amount of comedy. It has, to me, it's nearly a perfect film. The first one, so yeah. Check this is the JJ movie T slash so game reviews. Let me know what y'all think of everyone about this trilogy. It's a great trilogy. Check it out. All right, have a good day. Bye bye.